ancestors, can you please help me to give out what I need to know? To the energy flow. Can you help me out here? Can you help me out a little bit here? Courage. Okay. Courage. Mood. Yeah. There's people who are getting mad at people's courages. Yeah, there's people getting mad at people's courage of understanding a story here, actually. So this is making people have courage to want to be in mood to try to bring hostilities. Trying to be in a group, actually, at that, too. Having the courage to speak up, which is making people very moody. That means they are having a guilty conscience at that, too. Fancy. Somebody thinks they're fancy of how they're trying to bring hostilities. Fancy on how to disrespect people to the table. And trying to mess with people's free flow at that, too. What's messing with the free flow? Yep, there's attitude. People are mad because you're being encouraged to understand people's flow as disrespectful that they need to learn how to love themselves and stop going after people. Defense, bickering, bickering back and forth. That's all it is. People are bickering now. Bickering, confrontational. So that's what it is. Somebody is being confrontational about a situation. About friendships, I believe. Yeah, friendship, relationship, building. Cam, camaraderie and competition. So there's competition here. Why somebody's bickering, fighting, trying to bring you hostilities about your courage, about your free flow. How about you? Re how you respect? So you have the courage to know how to be confrontational in a respectful way. And there's people who are doing it disrespectfully. All right, what is courage? Be humble, exactly. When you know how to be humble, you know how to do free flow about a situation, there's going to be humbleness here. First quarter moon in Leo. Somebody's going to be humble about this. There's going to be some type of a respect of understanding who is being respectful and who's being disrespectful. Like I said, it's about friendship and building to bring conflict. That's what it has to deal with. There's people who's going to be encouraged to understand free flow. People need to learn how to be humble and stop trying to bring conversational and attitude because a situation will be brought to the light. It will be shed. Shed upon. New moon and Leo. Shine. The situation is being shining upon. It's being shed light. To a situation. Itself. That's why people are mad. That's why people want to get into a group. Because they think that it's fancy of how they want to attack certain individuals in a group. They think it's fancy of how they're trying to plot something in a pattern way. These people need to think it through. New Moon and Gemini, their fancy of 
not loving themselves of trying to bring you conflict, hostility, because they have an attitude, to you having the courage of having free flow of knowing when to be humble. That's why they're mad at you, because you're bringing something that is shining to the table. And they're mad at you because they, they know you are respected. That's what it is. You're respected. Some people are not. Because that's what it is. They cannot let go of their fear. That's what it is. Their friends, their family, they have fears they cannot let go of as of right now. That's why they want to come after you. They are pretending to act like they respect you, but they truthfully do not respect you. They want to cause you harm. They want to bring hostilities your way of any type. And they are fearing of what you know and what you understand about. Know you are loved. Yeah, these people... Are making it out to make you feel like you're not loved. You're not cared for. Their attitude is showing you. Their true colors of who they are. That's why they're being confrontational. This is pretty much what they're trying to do. They're trying to get it to where people don't care about you. But they do care about you. That is the thing here. People really do care about you. And they're trying to make it to where nobody else will care about you. That nobody will respect you. All they care about is getting people in a group wanting to attack you. Plot something on you. That's what it is. There, there's just energy flow of protecting others. And then there's others who are not going to protect so there's two different type of courages here. There's courage of being respected and letting a situation be shine. Why people are in fear mode. And then there's other people who are mad as hell. Because you are catching on to their fears of what they don't want you to understand about. There's a pattern of a triangle here that's what these people are so mad about they want to get people in a group they're showing attitude because you're shedding light upon a situation what they're bickering and bitching about they have fears because you have the courage to bring it out to the light. That's why you're very well respected. And some of these people are not. So well respected. At that too. What is humble about. And. Free flow of energy. Fluidity. What is that about? What's humble about? What's humble about? Four of water. Missing an opportunity. Discontentment. Or boredom. Open your eyes to the possibility. So yeah. Somebody's going to be missing the opportunity. Of trying to fuck with you. Or trying to plan. A murder. They're going to be missing an opportunity that they're not going to be able to mess with your courage. They're not going to be able to make people get in a group. They're not going to be able to have people to gang up on you. They're not going to be able to do this. Awakening. Look at things from a different perspective. A temporary standstill. It's important to be yourself. Yeah, there's already people awoken to this scenario that that's why it's shining that's why these people are mad because people are spiritually awoke to the death patterns to murder plans that is adding up that's why these people are mad and given attitude 
because you're letting it shine of what are people trying to plot why are people trying to do a murder pattern that's why these people are mad as fuck let them be mad because they actually told on themselves yeah trying to be fancy think it through oh yeah three of air great sadness take time to heal the need to forgive yourself and others yeah they feel great sadness that they're going to have to heal. They're going to have to heal, actually. There's a great time of sadness here. And it's time for healing. It's time to be spiritually awoke to people who are trying to plot and plan. It's actually near water, woods, or at a stop sign or four-way that's pretty much the pattern pretty much yeah six of fire victory good news it's on its way of public recognition yeah so that's why people fear fear how you're respected is because you're going to be getting victory and good news about these people of why they are trying to be confrontational. Ace of Fire. An exciting new opportunity, career, advancement, change your life now. Exactly. They fear that they're going to be getting a loss of respect. Their friends may not respect them as much anymore. And this has to do with the emotional side of things at the moment. This is very emotional stuff. It's talking about a pattern of people trying to plot against other people as of right now. Lay solid foundation. Magic works through you. Yeah, you are never alone. Exactly, you're never alone. Take a time out. Trust in the magic. Yeah. You're trusting the magic, actually. Lay solid foundation. The beaver spirit. Scarab beetle spirit. That has to do with the warning of attacking people. You know, I just actually talked about beetles. And now I'm thinking about it. This card goes with people being under attack. That's going to be about to be attacked. Something really bad happening. You know, that's really something. So yeah, these people are going to miss an opportunity to have a solid foundation of trying to mess with humbleness. They're not going to be able to mess with the free flow of what is coming out to be exposed. So the beetle spirit, that's what people are awoken to. That That's why they want to bring you conversational. That's why they got attitude. And that is um, the Egypt god of beetles. I've talked about this before in one of my readings. Utter spirit, you are never alone. Yeah. These people literally thinks that you're not fancy. They think they think that you don't love yourself, but they should have thought it through because now they're starting to find out that you are not alone. And then um the victory good news take a time out that these people are going to have to take a time out. Pretty much spirit is going to put their asses in time out. They're going to have to take a time out of understanding of what they did to the energy flow here. And trust in the magic. Yeah, I do. Somebody needs to surrender... 
Yeah, they're going to have to learn how to surrender. Moth spirit. Dragon. Dragonfly spirit. Truth transcends illusions. And take a leap of faith. The grasshopper spirit. So somebody is trying to act froggy. That they need to surrender. They need to surrender now. And leave it alone. So this is showing me that these people are not backing off. Of plotting a murder. They are not surrendering. And they will try to mind fuck the hell out of you too. Truth, tr truth transcends illusions. They're trying to mind fuck people to where it's not. It's they're pretty much trying to hide the fact of what you understand. They're taking a leap of faith where they're gonna have to take a time out and understanding that people do at some point are taking a leap of faith of understanding the respect part it's what it is that they're gonna have to learn stop being conversational to the bullshit of what you're being a part of because that's pretty much why people are getting so damn offensive. It's because they know what they're doing. They need to surrender. And people are not understanding. They need to surrender. And they're not going to. They're ignoring the heave of warnings. To back off and stop trying to do a murder plan. That is a pattern. They're not knocking it off. So, got the holy mountain magic. So, it is black magic. And it also could have been black magic who also, they need to surrender the magic. They need to stop doing magic upon people. They need to surrender somehow to the holy mountain. Magic of trying to mindfuck people by them trying to do lies, reverse psychology. Pretty much they're mad at you and got an attitude is because there's beauty, a beauty way of how you're taking a leap of faith. You're seeing this in a beauty way that these people shall not get away with their bullshit no more. It is actually going to be a beautiful way of how these people are on a vision quest at that too. This is a divine quest for something I'm not for sure about. That's all they're going to tell me too. They won't go in anymore with me. Let me see. What is the lessons here of not surrendering? There's health. Regret and death. Freedom. So that's pretty much what it is. That these people needs to surrender. And also they're bringing everybody else health issues. They're bringing them stress. De-stress. And they will regret. Of trying to get people in a group. Trying to mind fuck a situation with magic. By word magic. And the beauty way. What I'm, get, what I'm getting here. Is that there's going to be a death to a situation. That they're not going to be able to disrespect you anymore. Because they're in fear. They're scared you're going to get a victory out of this. This is pretty much their lessons. A situation will be put to a death. You need to stop bringing health issues, stress, de-stress to other people and loved ones. Because you are caught. Let me see. What is for health? What is this about? Ten of Wands, Regret, Burden, 
and the moon. All right. So somebody's going to be burdened as hell because the truth is coming to the light about a murder pattern. That's why people are getting so freaking mad. Like I said, there's going to be the ace of ace of swords to death. It's going to be put to an end. The situation is brought to the light. And it's going to shed light upon. Somebody's going to regret. For using the seven of pentacles. And trying to use. The three. The three of wands. Pretty much. It has to do with money. Killing. Murder. People trying to hide it in the dark. Ace of Swords, I believe, is somewhat speaking the truth. That this situation will be put to a death. Because people try to use money in the situation. There's better days coming. But the moon in secret, they're going to be having burdens... Because everything came to the light and it's the truth to a situation that death, it was over because of money. Somebody got greedy, something about with money, and wanted people dead, so they paid people off. They will regret this from not backing off. The world, the world... Is going to have regret. Nobody's going to have the world in their hands. The world is about to bring them true burdens. That's what it is. The moon, secrets hidden in the dark, is coming to the light. That's what's going to happen is because financial constraints. They're going to have um, money issues. Because they're using all their money to plot and plan murders in groups of people. What is the truth? What is the truth? It's about caring connections. It's about people, places, things, accomplices, friends of who they know. It is a connection to why there is a murder pattern. It's about connections to one another. At that too. What is the death card about? What is the death card? Oh. Okay. See three of wands. Days will look better. Rest to rejuvenate. Yeah. A situation will be put to a death where you can actually rest and rejuvenate. That people are going to have to work. On their first chakra of what they're trying to do. The first chakra is the head chakra. I think I believe it's the crown. Somebody has thoughts of getting everybody else murdered in a group. There's already people who have already died from a triangle. And then they got other people... That they're wanting gone. Whoever did this. They're all tied up. Alright. They're all tied up. In a very messy truth situation. That it came to the light. That's why people are being confrontational. That's why people want to get into a group. To try to come after you. But it's going to bring them burdens. It's going to bring them health issues. They're going to have regret and the truth is there's death twice out here so a situation is either going to be put to a death or there's death going to happen to these individuals I say karma yep the world is going to be a word of a mouth somebody's actually going to be communicating about this they're going to communicate this with someone 
So let me see the world ace of cups right with the sword ace of swords. There's six of wands. What else is here? Strength. So yeah, the star. All right. So the world ten. Yeah, you're actually going to be getting word of a mouth from a page of wands about what the world is planning on what they're doing and it actually comes to a situation that they're trying to somewhat take out a couple the ace of swords is the truth and it's being seen by the third eye that these people are caught of what they're doing and death Rest rejuvenate. You're going to be having a victory. You are very well respected. You are very well known in the public eye. Because nobody can't seem to keep their name out of your, out of their mouth. Pretty much. People are bragging. It is out and about in the energy flow. Yeah. Strength. They're trying to mess with your strength. Actually, their strengths are being played with as of right now. Oh, my card just moved. Yeah, so somebody was wishing on a star is Aquarius, but you also have the Nine of Wands. Somebody literally wanted you to feel like you were all tied up. You were in fear of death. These people were trying to bring you burdens of what they're doing. They will regret that of trying to manipulate a situation at that too. Nine of Swords is pretty much trying to take away your freedom to where you feel like you can't go on anymore. These people just got tied up in some really messy situations that is going to really... Ace of Swords is actually speaking the truth about a murder of some stuff. That it is being planned, actually. This is a murder triangle. The three are already gone. Now they're going after more people. That's involving a murder case. Planning murder. One was near a stop sign. One was near water and one was killed in a field or the woods. This is a murder pattern. Now these people, just pretty much be careful what you wish for. You better be careful on who you are connecting with. Because these people are not going to be respected. Their friends are involved. Caring connections. It means it could be a lover or whoever it is. There's death here twice. And death has to do with a grim reaper too. The moon. Stuff that happened in the dark is coming to the light. That's why it says surrender now. And there's people not surrendering this type of murder plot. These people... Are still having it planned. They're spacing the years out. To when to strike. When to murder someone. And the Ace of Swords is actually speaking the truth. It's truth. And the third eye. Is caught. Seeing it with your third eye. The ancestors are seeing this. In the spiritual realm. They're also a truth speaker too. That's what they got themselves all caught up in. That's why they want to bring drama. But they're going to bring their selves. The only thing they brought in their world. Is people talking amongst it. Whoever is bragging. About murdering. About four more people. That's who I'm talking about. And I know exactly who they are. I've already figured it out. 
I already got one list of people. The one threatened that if anybody ever spoke their mouth, this person was going to take him out in the woods and bury four people out in the woods if they would have opened their mouth. You know what? That just says a lot. And that is the truth. There's people who are getting very nervous because they're getting caught of murdering the same people that I knew. Trying to kill four more people off. Ain't that some? So if people start acting weird, they act guilty. That's their burden to carry. And it just stated they're in mood. Mood means from the hip hop queen, people are trying to gang up on you. They're trying to bring you hostilities. And it's being shed on. It's being shined upon. This situation is very truthful. And it's very hasty. And spirit wants it out. These people just got themselves all tied up. In some really fucked up shit. This has to do with magic too. There's people even doing death magic. While I'm thinking about it. These people are messing with something. They're trying to mess with people's strengths. They're trying to mess with the truth that you're speaking of. These people who are going around bragging about murdering Curvin Curtis, bragging about killing off, um, shoot, what's his name? Matt Watson and another person. It's a, it's a triangle. It's a, it's a murder pattern. That's why all these people are acting the fuck up. Karma's here, and it's truth. That That's why these people are acting up. That's why they're getting scared. That's why they're threatening to press charges. This is why people want to act up. But you want to know something? Why does somebody have to watch what they say? Because that's what they do. These people are trying to manipulate to where the truth don't get out. And I know who the murderers are. There's actually more names that I know about. But I'm going to keep that quiet. Let's just say that it's the list that I had first. And there's about maybe two more people. But I'm going to leave it alone. I'm not going to say it because I don't want people at risk right now. I've already caught on been hearing it because people are stupidly bragging about murdering people you know when somebody speaks the truth about this and it is being revealed through tarot this is some very serious shit very serious this is not a joke this is not something that you do with somebody this is not what you do. This is saying people are playing with your life. They're playing with your health. They're betting. They're playing with your life with money. With death. They're gambling. They got people purposely in the mix. That's not okay. Either. And there's victims. Who they're trying to go after next. Which is not very smart, but, you know, it is kind of funny how these people want to brag, brag, brag and run their mouth and then they get all offended like, oh, she said that on her YouTube? Did you tell her? Did you tell her this? Did you tell her that? Eventually they're all going to turn on themselves. It's because somebody opened their mouth. That's, that's the thing though. Once you find out about a murder plan, people will start getting so damn offensive and they will start personally attacking you. They will personally do everything and anything because they asses are guilty. And it's because my ancestors and God are speaking the truth about this is what's been going on. 
There are about four more people who are about to get murdered. Two. Two was already killed. There's a triangle. So, I don't know. Like I said, there's just too many people in the mix. Like I said, the first list that I have adds the fuck up. But there's two more. There's a male and another male. I'm going to keep that hush. But I know who the fuck it is. And you know, there's going to be people who's going to try to deny it. So, pretty much, it's probably better if I do say it. Because it is speaking truth. That Joseph Beadle and Mikey Largent possibly is in the mix of the murders too. Planning it, plotting it. Ace of Swords and Tarot Land. It's speaking the truth that these people shall not be able to deny it. And people can actually look at who they're contacting, who they're talking to. It's never hidden. <laughs> I promise you that. There's other people too. That's why, that's why they're threatening to press charges. Because of what you understand about. You know how guilty as fuck that makes them look? It just pretty much showed me that Matt Curvin were murdered. And these people are getting so fucking mad of the truth of getting out of who these people truly are. And also what's really weird, that one girl on that list knows Bobby Kinger. So, like I said, it's people who knows of people who knows of people on that list. That's like up to three X's. So, like I said, there's a lot of truth here. So that these people are showing. And the universe and God is saying these people need to surrender. But they're all tied up. They've already brought their own burdens. It's already seen. They're trying they're trying to mess with the coupled people. They're literally trying to take out a family dynamic. That's what it is. They're going after certain people because of what and who they're related to. These murderers are not very intelligent. I'm sorry. They're not. You know, that is very comical how these murderers keep popping up in my reading of figuring out a puzzle. Like I said, the beetle has to do with a warning from Egypt that others are trying to pull harm to get you jumped, to harm you. That's what mood is. They're trying to mind fuck the truth. And God knows all and sees all. That's why these people are so fucking fearful of what you understand of. That's why they're guilty. That's why they watch what you understand of. Because God is saying that I've pretty much spoken the truth on who are these killers are towards a plan or a murdering a circle of people off. It's a pattern. And God just revealed it tonight. Like I said, the white list with names, Joseph Beadle, Michael Largent. There's other people onto that too. Their clicks of their click. And it's being seen with the third eye. It is seen in the spiritual realm. Caring connections means a friend. Or they could be trying to 
date your friends, get close to them, to where they can not know why they're trying to date your friend is because they want information to get you fucking murdered. And you don't even realize it. That's what it is. Karma. A situation will be put to a stop and truth shall set you free. You shall not run from the truth because all your dark ass shit just came to the light. It's understanding the emotional side of all the burdens and somebody's chest is hurting really bad. Like it's really so tensed that it feels like somebody's literally having an ass panic attack. They're having a panic attack as of right now. Or somebody's going to be having a really bad anxiety attack because they just got caught up in the mix of a murder plan a plot. Like I said, it was on the cornfield. It's near woods, water area, or near stop signs, or a fork crossroad. These people are going to be nervous as hell that this got out by the truth tonight. This is not something to be playing with. You don't go out there pl planning murder upon people and then try to fucking hide it. And if people are bragging, you just pretty much, God just caught you. My ancestors caught you. And Curved and Matt is helping out to know who you motherfuckers are as well. Uh, Jamie Stephan also somewhat knows about this plot I feel bad for certain individuals because I know some people who are innocent and I know some people are going to be doing something so damn stupid that I really don't want innocent people getting hurt I really don't I, I would I really feel really bad but some people are not innocent at that too That's why it's better to understand. This is why people get intimidated. This is why they want to pull. Oh, well, I'm going to press charges on you. Well, you know, somebody from a horse's mouth, it gets one to another and then it gets back to somebody else and they hear the exact same thing of a rumor that they're trying to pull a murder case of trying to make a pattern out of it. Common sense, like people are going to be using their discernment. They are going to be able to fully understand this. This is actually somebody's wish that you wouldn't be able to survive. Somebody is just trying to bring you very, very ruthless energy. Somebody is literally in fear mode how you understand their murder, serial killer mindset. They're shocked. They're caught. That's why they watch my YouTube. Because they know who the fuck they are. They're caught. Of killing Matt Watson and Curvin Curtis. And they're caught of also of trying to plan upon me. And yeah, me, another person, another person, and another person. They are caught of trying to get it to where they actually are spreading the years out. So nobody would be prepared for it. That is the truth. You know how, how uh, Matt died one year? It spread it out. And then he got hit. That's what they're trying to do of attacking someone. It's a... It's a really weird long period of a serial killer's mindset. They're trying to wait years of separating it so it doesn't make any sense. It's being separated out. 
That is the truth. These people are caught. And God is giving out the truth. So, I don't know. I really don't know what you want me to do. Because if you get triggered by the truth. And you know who you are. And you know you're caught. And you know you got a part in it. Then you're guilty. But if you're just stalking my YouTube the only thing I could say is that, truthfully, if you were innocent, then why do you gotta stalk my YouTube? You have a guilty-ass fucking conscience. And my family already knows about half you fuckers who are planning murder, too. You got others' attention. You know, it's really weird. These murderers and killers... Only go after people who don't understand it. But once once, once you actually got a killer and a, a murderer and a serial killer who gets on your shit. And they start to understand. You're starting to understand how they move, how they think. They get intimidated as fuck. That's when they want to act up. They are completely in disbelief. They are speechless because of what you're understanding. This is perfectly of understanding. This is why people are getting mad. It is connections to different people, places, things. Why they're all tied up. And their secrets are coming out of what they try to hide. This is a pattern of murdering people in different year spaces. They just brought themselves burdens upon their world. Do you want to act up? That's on you. You have a guilty ass conscience? That's on you. You got all tied up in some bullshit? That's on you. You have the choice. To not get involved in it. And there's people who are preferring to be a part in it. Try, trying to do something to where you are so weak. That you're not going to be able to fight no more. They're trying to drain your energy so fucking bad. And they know it's not working. And they don't like it how intelligent you are. That makes it more difficult for them to even do a fucking thing. Because they know cops can even look at people's YouTubes as well. You got others who can actually tell you if the energy needs to do more research or if it's dead on. Energy never lies. So I would like to say, I've even said I haven't caught my past life killers. And they're here. They are showing their asses off. These murderers are showing themselves that they got the ten of fire. Too much work except help from others. Life is out of balance. Stress related health concerns. Yeah. They just completely brought themselves health concerns because of what they did to others. It's called karma. That is the truth. At that too. These people who are plotting, planning, Spreading the years out to secretly attack you. To secretly try to get you murdered. Oh yeah. They're going to be having health concerns. To where they will be brought to their knees. To where they ain't going to feel like they can go on any further. Everything you do is going to backfire on them. It's going to backfire on the murderers. Attempted murderers. And serial killers. Trust me, all this shit will backfire on them. Why do you think... Why do you think people don't like people who understands a mindset of a murderer or a killer? And it's also somewhere in your birth chart how you can understand dark energies. I understand demonology. <laughs> and I even talk. I understand the spiritual realm. I have access to the spiritual realm. I can go there. A lot of people have spoken in the spiritual realm of what they're wanting to do. It's an echo. Then it gets back to certain people. 
without without even trying. It's divine timing. Everything comes out when it's supposed to. But this is supposed to protect people. What they need to be aware of. A friends of friends is pretty much saying that if your friends have a random ass person who is out to get you and they don't realize it, that is the truth. That That is how somebody is going to try to plot murder in a weird triangle dynamic. That's what they're going to try to do. They're going to try to date your friends, trying to get them to say you're crazy, trying to get them to admit that they're nicey-nicey, and then that's when they're going to get you. I really, I really hope people out here have some really, really decent intelligence to understand that somebody murdering or having a pattern of trying to kill people off. I really hope people can have an understanding that this is not funny. This is not something that's a joke. That's why the killers don't respect you. Because you speak the fucking truth. That a situation will bring a death to a situation. Or they're going to die from having health issues. They will regret what they've done. And they don't want to hear the truth. To what they've done in the dark. Trying, trying to bring you down so fucking bad. Trying to make you spiritually sick. Messing with you on a very bad level of trying to make you feel like you lost your faith. I promise you, God will bring them to their knees. The exact same evil they've done to others, it's an echo. Send back to sender. And if they get offended by the Ace of Cups... By what you are seeing, what your ancestors are seeing, what is being seen by the third eye. And you are seeing who they're talking to. You know who these people are. And that is the truth. You know who's innocent and you know who's not. To who's doing what. Who has a part in what. It's a pattern. And that is the truth. That's what they're trying to hide. Now that it's out, they're going to be feeling God's wrath. They're going to be feeling the fact of they're going to be having health issues. Their ego death is really going to screw them up. Or they're going to die from trying to bring death to you. God works in the most mysterious ways. If you do more evil than good... God will bring you back all the evil shit you have done. I promise you, it'll make you want to pull a suicide. You ain't going to be able to handle it, all the shit you've done to others. How much pain you've hurt others and put them through. I promise you, you're probably going to be wanting to pull a suicide. That's how these murderers are scared and freaked out. How you understand them. Eventually, it's going to get to the point to where karma is going to come back on them. Where the ancestors are going to be ganging up on them. Hell, who knows? These people might actually get tied up in their own bullshit. They actually pulled themselves a rope. While I'm thinking about it, all tied up. You're tied up and rope you can't fucking go anywhere. So pretty much your, your killers, who you're calling out, they just pretty much pulled themselves a rope. Because somebody's conscience is guilty. They are nervous. About the situation. They have burdens. They're trying to hide what they feel. Because they don't want the truth out. To who the fuck they're talking to. Has to do with money. They're trying to mess. All tied up in hostilities. Exactly. They're trying to take away your freedom. They're going to have to stop trying to know all the answers. Three of Wands. Days, better days are coming. And they're not going to be able to mind fuck. They're not going to be able to confuse people of this. Who is having a spiritual awakening. You're not going to be able to confuse people. 
of what you're doing. That is the truth. That is the Ace of Swords. It is the truth. People are trying to mind fuck you into thinking, oh, everything's okay. It's actually going to be a better day. They're mind fucking you. They're literally trying to confuse you to where you can't see what these people are planning. That's why these people are threatening, trying to press charges because they're guilty. They're trying to take away your freedom. They're trying to put the fear in God in you. And I promise you, and that's also the truth too, they ain't ready. They ain't ready for God to put the fear in them fuckers. I promise you, they ain't ready for that. They ain't ready for the Grim Reaper or death either. I promise you that. You try to confuse somebody about hostilities. So like for an example, you, you're sitting there saying, No, I'm not. No, I'm not trying to get people to get in a group to go after them. No, I'm not trying to bring hostilities. Well, <laughs> you got the, got the Ten of Wands. You got the Moon. Means you got a guilty conscience. Of hiding that shit, not speaking the truth, confusing people to not know the truth. You're all tied up. Now you're going to be mind fucked and confused out of your damn mind. Because you don't know how to go to the beat of your own drum. That's why you're confrontational. Because somebody, somebody's about to go wild on these fucking murderers. Full Moon and Leo, go fucking wild. Meaning these people are not ready for God and the ancestors and the truth to go fucking wild. They're not ready for people to go wild on these people. They're, they're not ready for it. They're not ready for the hostilities to backfire either. They're not ready for it. Promise you that. Let me see. Yep, see, seeing the big picture. Yeah, there's people who see a big picture here of why people are bickering and bitching. It's because they want to fucking fight you because you know the truth. So there it is. That's what it is. They're trying to know all the answers to how you understand this. Uh uh. Because they don't know how to go to the beat of their own drum. There's somebody's bitch on a puppet on a string. Now they want to fight you because you call the murderers out to their plot and plan of murder. That's what it is. Now they want to fight you. They want to get violent with you because they can't, they can't really get anything over you. Shit happened in the dark will come to the light. And I just did a, I just did a reading about that not too long ago. So, yeah, but this is all I got. For tonight. Hopefully it helped somebody. Out there. Or to understand. Of people who are bragging and running that mouth. They just pretty much told them. Told on themselves. By going out there yip yapping. And running that mouth. So the rumors are truth. They are not false informationing. The truth is that people are confused on the situation. But these people, the murderers who are talking, they're actually speaking the truth to you, but confusing you at the same time so you don't catch on to their truth. That's why they're going to fight you. That's why they don't know how to go be their own drum. That's why they're about to have people to go wild on them for what they're cheerfully doing but this is all i got and i hope you guys have a good night